I am Adil Kumar. Welcome to my series on Domain of Composite Functions. You need to find the domain of the function sine inverse of log to the base 3, 3 to the power of x over 3. You can always pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. Now let's first talk about the inverse function and then we'll get into the details. The graph of sine function is uh, kind of like this, right? Now you will notice that this graph fails the horizontal line test and therefore its inverse cannot be a function. So only portion which we consider is between minus pi by 2 to plus pi by 2. Within this restricted domain from minus pi by 2 to plus pi by 2, we could have inverse of sine function. Secondly, in this domain, it also provides you with all the values of sine, which is from minus 1 to 1. So it makes sense to restrict the trigonometric functions and then work on their inverse. Right? So if I have to sketch the inverse of this particular function, how will it look like? Well, this particular point is minus pi by 2 minus 1. Here, that one is pi by 2, 1, and then we have origin 0, 0. So when we do the inverse, they flip, they swap, right? So we get a point which is minus 1 minus pi by 2, right? So in the inverse, we get minus 1 and minus pi pi by 2. Let's say this point here is minus 1 minus pi by 2. Inverse 0, 0, 0 remains the same. And then for this particular point, which is pi by 2, 1, it becomes 1 pi by 2, right? So 1 pi by 2, let's say it is here. Connecting these points, we get the inverse of this particular function. And it can be graphed as kind of like this where these points for us now are 1 pi by 2 and this will be minus 1 pi by 2 and that will be the origin so this becomes sine inverse of x right and this was sine of x is that clear to you so y equals to sine Now, let's get back to the question. What we really want to figure out is domain of this function. So when we say domain of this function, then these values, which are from minus 1 to plus 1, correct? So that is the domain of sine inverse function. Perfect. So as far as the domain is concerned, we know that this value of log to the base 3 of 3 to the power of x over 3 should be greater than or equal to minus 1 but less than or equal to 1. Clear? Now, understanding the log functions, if the base and this is x, that means we could write this as x over 3 using the power rule and we can write this as log 3 of 3. That should be between minus 1 to plus 1 log to the base 3 of 3 is 1 so we get minus 1 is less than or equal to x by 3 and that should be less than or equal to 1 now we can multiply by 3 we get minus 3 x is greater than or equal to and it is less than or equal to 3 so that becomes the domain of the function right so we have our answer and that is the domain will be from minus 3 to plus 3 for the given function. So I hope that is absolutely clear. Feel free to write your comment, share your views and if you like and subscribe to my videos that would be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.